Hey guys, Ben plays here. Welcome to episode three of uh, FTB Sky Odyssey. I knew the name would come to me eventually. I'm about to craft a thing, a very nice thing, that will help me build. Um, structures easier. Enhanced building guide. Changing to cylinder mode. All right, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Okay, but I want to... Okay, that's... Eh. I don't know if I like that. Okay, so nailed panels, and then I can just do this, boop, 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 and they'll start building a thing of panels. Nice. Man, I wish I had a building gadget. Not that it'll be too hard to make one, but it will be hard to power one at this early game stage. I like Monokuma's English laugh better. Hey, you guys probably don't know who Monokuma is. Since I haven't played that game on my channel, and I don't plan to because I've already beaten it, and it's not a game that is really replayable. Speaking of which, I need to get back to my replay of the first game because um, I'm trying to get all the achievements done and um, I have to replay the first game because I lost my 
progress. Oh, whoops. Okay, so I've got a circular platform. That's nice. Um, this is a very large platform. I think I can put my machines in here for sure. Um, I kind of want to break the stone stairs in the center. Okay, I should definitely get some progress going. I got an apple. Okay, I'm gonna need... Hmm. Well, I do need to get some progress going, so... Where were we? Oh yeah. I was flirting with power. Yeah, I don't love the um, circular shape for machines. Okay, I'm going to grab a second pulverizer. Nah, not yet. Alright. Um, we're going to work on EMC generation soon, too. But... Um, First, I need to get all my machines up and running. Okay, boop. And on this side, I'm going to put this. <coughs> okay. Iron and nickel. We're going to pulverize these. Norton, go away. Okay. Okay, Invar blend. Turns into Invar. Boom. Okay, where was I? <laughs> Maybe I'll make a satchel. How's that sound? Hmm. 
Hmm. Okay. I'm going to teach Invar Gears to the crafting table because I'm going to need one in a minute for something else. Induction smelter. How many coins do I get for that? That is a lot of coins. And so I'm going to purchase a Vulcanite amulet. Teach this to the transmutation tablet. Just in case I lose it. Uh, coal. Gonna grab charcoal. Boom. This is gonna be slow. This can transfer 1000 RF per tick? Okay. I need silver. Let's pulverize it just for the heck of it. Okay. Okay, these are creating 40 RF per tick each. I'm gonna place down my induction smelter temporarily. And grab some copper and some tin. Make bronze.
Damn watch. All right. Oof, wow. Dang, dude. We're good. I'll accept the boost of experience. Or EMC, not experience. <clears throat> okay, back to this trick. Okay, I'm gonna... Hmm. Wherever I put this next thing, it's gonna be pretty much permanent. Okay. A basic energy cell. Vibrant capacitor bank. How much does that give? Oil generator? How much does that give? Okay. I want to try and get as many of these things as early as possible. Like 50 buckets of resident ender should not be too hard to automate. Once we get a EMC link. But we're still a ways away from that. Okay, let's grab some glowstone. One, two, three, four, five, six. Glass. Okay. I need obsidian. Okay, but that should... Okay, clay. I was hoping it would give me the clay chicken. Speaking of which, I want to start breeding chickens relatively soon. How would stained grass look? Colored grass look as... Hmm. The wheels are turning. The wheels are most definitely turning.
Um, whatever I do, this is probably going to be a permanent location for this. So. Okay, let's get our first bit of water as well. Okay, gonna hold on to the Vulcanite amulet. Okay, so I'm going to buy a rubber tree sapling. So that I can start getting into industrial craft. Um, because it's gonna need it's gonna be needed for um, certain things. Okay, I'm changing to emerald ore for this. Give me an Evertide amulet, please. Ow, that noise. Hurt my ears a little bit, not gonna lie. Um. Okay, bucket. Mm, water. Water, water. Lava, lava. Boop, 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 boop. Obsidian. Cool. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Glass is a good friend of mine. Antimatter relay. Boom. We're just knocking out quests left and right. We're starting to get a little nest egg on our points, which is nice. Speaking of eggs, chickens are going to be my next goal. Although I'm going to want a more enclosed space for chickens. So, in the next episode, I think I'm going to expand the base out this direction, move all this stuff, um, yeah, I'm going to expand the base out in all four directions, move all my machines over into each of these rooms, Um, I'm also going to, um, hmm. build a basement, I think. Not for this level, but for, um, well, yeah, for this level, too. Okay, I think I'm going to copy this world. 
and experiment in creative mode for a bit. And then I'll come back to the non-creative mode version of the world. Alright, we're doing fine with EMC generation now. See, I've already got one million EMC. Okay, I have no I have no way of actually using this Klein Star at the moment, but I'm gonna craft one. Okay. And I'm going to try and get either a Swift Wolf's Rending Gale. Okay, which is easier? Angel Ring? Let's see. Angel Ring uses grid power though. Chicken wing ring is leadstone jetpack. Leather. How do we get leather? How are we going to get rotten flesh? I guess I could make a cow farm. Oh, I know how we'll get leather. It's really not that hard. Kill a cow. <laughs> Duh. So yeah, I'm gonna go experiment in creative mode. And we'll try to get a flight next time. That's a big ask, actually. See you guys in the next episode. Peace.